First time in, uh, we go to the Chinese Grand Prix in the beginning of the season, normally we were coming here in the end. Uh, Chinese people say that it's a re rainy period but, uh, of the season, of the year, but uh, until now it was not raining. Weather forecast uh, were saying rain, but until now everything is fine. Whatever is coming, I think we are prepared for both conditions. Shanghai as a circuit is quite challenging, of course, uh, there are some nice sections, especially first corner, which is uh, becoming a complex of the corners, corner one, corner two and corner three. Uh, is uh, quite a big challenge as uh, uh, the blind of uh, the apex of the second uh, corner, the curb is blind, so you go, you approach first corner, which is quite long tightening corner, and then uh, this corner goes directly into uh, apex of the second corner which is quite a low speed corner so it's quite challenging uh, especially in early laps to understand where is the grip all the car is rolling so the, the brake points are not only one but few brake points uh, it's quite difficult to, to also manage to uh, get first lap in qualifying straight away there as uh, this is first corner we are approaching uh, so overall first sector is quite challenging I uh, walked through the city the other day and just interesting to see their, their way of life. Um, it was pretty packed and um, very, very lively. And as you can see on TV, people are selling lots of different stuff on the road. Uh, also some things to eat, but um, I was not brave enough to, to try it. Just smelling it was already a bit, uh, bit dangerous. Yeah, but that's also obviously uh, fun. Not only the racing, but also traveling the world. Uh, there is a lot of fans. Uh, yeah, atmosphere is, is quite nice. Of course, uh, uh, it's a completely different mentality than uh, in Europe. So uh, it's just different. Driving here in Shanghai on normal roads really is, is dangerous. Um, I would prefer to drive myself, but unfortunately you are not allowed if you don't have a, a driving license, a Chinese driving license, and it's not so easy to get one. So we have a chauffeur, but you have to be lucky to, to catch a good one. Some years you are, others you are not. And um, it really is dangerous as I experienced last year when we had a, a small crash on the motorway, nothing big, but Unfortunately, each year you see quite, uh, quite a big accident and it may sound funny, but it, it really is scary.